right guys, this is the EasyViz BC2. It's a brand new camera from EasyViz. I reviewed some of their cameras in the past and this is a very mini portable magnetic camera, which I'm excited to try out. Just to run through some of the specifications, this also provides you with two-way talk capabilities and I will give you some sample demos on that. It also has night vision up to five meters. I will show you some sample footage, both daylight and nighttime. It also is compatible with your Amazon Alexa and also with Google Assistant. To save all your video files, you can also add a micro SD card up to 256 gigabytes of storage, but you can also subscribe to the EasyViz Cloud Play option, which is something that I tend to do. This also has a rechargeable battery powered by micro USB, which gives you up to 50 days of recording capabilities on a full charge. And this is 2000 milliamp hours of battery life. This is full HD, like I mentioned, it's 1080p, which I think is great for a camera of this size. And I'll show you how compact this actually is. And there's a few ways you can mount this, including the magnetic base that it comes with. Let's open the box. So just in here, you have yourself all of the information and warranty guides, and then you have the camera itself. This is very tiny. And before I unwrap that, this is the magnetic base. This side attaches to the back of the camera, and then this side will attach to either the wall or a magnetic surface, or you can screw it in and I'll showcase how you can do that. But essentially this is a 360 degree ball head, which you can rotate to position the camera in whichever convenient manner is useful to you. There's a side slot here with some of the accessories. So of course you have yourself the micro USB cable to charge it up. You also have some screws and wall plugs. And to complement that, you have this metallic attachment, which will be used for the magnetic base. And the magnetic strength on this is actually very strong. Now this is so easy just to clip if you wanted to have this in a certain position all the time. And it does require a little bit of force to take off. And this just proves how strong the magnet is because I'm actually still struggling to just pull it apart. If you didn't want to screw this into a wall, this actually comes with some adhesive stickers as well. If you just want to place it on a wall or a shelf or something, then you can take the adhesive label off the back of this, connect it to the metallic plate, just like this, and then you just stick it wherever you like and use that. So it's very convenient. Let me go ahead and peel some of this wrapping off of it. There you go, look how compact that is. You've got the speakers there just on the top. There's your camera lens, and then you have a infrared sensor there as well. So on the back of the camera, you've got your micro SD card slot, the micro USB port, a reset button, and the power button. So I'm going to connect this, and this will be on the base there, where the barcode label is. There you go. Look at that, very compact, very easy to attach. And anytime you wanna charge it, just take it off, Put it back on and then you're ready to go again so let's go ahead dive in power this on charge this up and give you guys a sample on how to connect this via the easy viz app so i have the easy viz app these are my three cameras that i already have and they do great and by the way i'll link my videos down below for reviewing some of my other easy viz cameras if you guys wanted to check that out let's go ahead and power this on start up successful startup is successful now I should be ready to pair this with my phone. Let's go ahead and look for the camera. So you do plus, cameras, and then you scan the barcode, which is at the bottom. There you go. It has found it. Go through the steps. Connecting to Wi-Fi. Please wait. And that's it. Pretty straightforward. You go through the rest of the steps and it should be connected. Wi-Fi connected. Platform registration successful. Configuration complete. Welcome to EasyViz. There we go. The camera is now ready. How quick and easy was that? So all I need to do is give it a name and then make sure everything is set up how I like. And then I'm ready to give you guys a sample of how it looks and sounds. Okay, guys, can you see where it is on the shelf at the back? Just there with the blue light. I'm going to give you some samples 
of how the video quality is and the audio quality because I've set it to the maximum resolution at 1080p and this might not be the final place that I leave it but it's very portable so you, wherever you want to place this inside your house it will do an excellent job. So let me go ahead and show you some sample demos of recording videos of that and showing the response time, the colors, the quality of the video and also the quality of the audio. So let's take a look at that now. So how are you guys seeing the video quality? on this camera. Now it's super portable. Of course, I have a window behind me, so it's going to be a little bit darker to see me as compared to if the camera was facing away from the window. But again, looking at the video quality in conjunction with the audio quality, what do you guys think? Now this is you know, pretty much on par with some of the larger EasyViz cameras that are connected to a mains or are also battery powered. I think this does an excellent quality in terms of the video just as good as those ones and this is much more compact and much more affordable than the other cameras that I have. So for me, I'm pretty impressed on that front. Now I've placed the camera towards the window so the light is coming from behind the camera and look at the difference in the quality. I am now super clear and this is really a HD video and in just this pocket size thing, I'm absolutely impressed. But what I want to do now is also check the night vision mode and see when it is very dark how good it performs. Okay guys, it is pitch black in here. I've closed all the shutters, I've turned off all the lights and it's so dark. Again, you can see how clear the night vision works. And I'm about two meters away from the camera right now and it does mention you know up to five meters away. Here you are, I'm five meters away from the camera and you guys can see, you know, pretty much you can still see the person, although it's not super clear as in daylight, you can still make out the person's image, their size, and some core details. Of course, I'm speaking from very far away, so the audio might not be super clear, but as I get closer, the sound will be becoming a lot clearer for you guys. Again, the quality on the night vision mode on this is just as good as some of the larger, more high-end EC-Viz cameras. So, for me, they've done a really good job with this type of camera and there's nothing really I can fault with the price you guys pay for this device. So what more can I say guys? I'm really impressed with this. This is the EasyViz BC2. Check out the links in the description in conjunction with having CloudPlay, which I do subscribe to. Now I have four cameras from EasyViz. I think this is the ultimate package for a bit of home security and more importantly, peace of mind. And some final thoughts from me, you know, if you are looking to get a camera for a bit of security and peace of mind around the house, maybe start off with something a little bit affordable and more portable, very easy to set up. This is the one to get. So I'm happy. Hopefully you guys found that useful. Make sure to subscribe. I have really cool reviews out every week with nice gadgets like this. And make sure to like this video and I'll catch you guys next time. Take care.